Hey, it's Jason from Bohemia Bees, and we're gonna do a real quick check on our observation hive. Uh, I've done a couple videos on what bees do during the winter, and I talk about the cluster in a ball in the colony to keep warm. Uh, talked about the queen continuing to lay a small amount of brood, but what does that look like, right? So a lot of us use the thermal images like you see here to get a sense as to you know what our bees are doing, what kind of activity they're doing inside of a colony. Um, but this can't tell the whole story unless you can really look inside. You don't want to look inside your colonies during the winter. You want to keep them closed up. Uh, some people, you know, wrap them like this, and others uh, will just leave them normal uh, and do a couple other different things to help the uh, temperature regulation, I should say, within a colony because it's not the cold that kills the bees. Right now it's about 30 degrees here on the Eastern shore of Maryland. It's about 745 at night. And the bees in our colonies that we have here in the apiary are, are still you know keeping busy within the colony, but they cluster in a ball to keep that brood warm. What does that look like? Let's take a look. We're gonna look at our brood. This is our observation hive that we have set up this year in our, our shop. I put a little bit of Let's show that what it looks like. Look at that. Look at that. They're clustered in a ball, keeping the heat all around the center of the colony and the brood. So anywhere there's brood in there, very small amount. They're feeding it, keeping it warm. And the temperature of that is, is actually woo, warm. It's probably about 93 degrees. I don't spot our queen. She's probably on the other side but she's still moving around and laying, which is definitely cool. They'll continue to do that and they'll continue to feed on any of the resources that they've, they put up here at the top and making sure they're bringing it down to the actual bees and the brood at the bottom. See over here, they've got some capped honey and they'll continue to use that. So that's what it would look like if you took out and opened your hives up, a big cluster of bees, a big ball of bees. This is a, a three frame in, uh, observation colony. So likely they cover the next two frames on both of these. You know, it's not gonna, they've not drawn out the other frames on the, on the back side, So they're gonna likely stay on this side. Um, but that's what it looks like inside. You know, this, um, there's a link to the video. I'll put that in the description to what bees do during the winter. You can watch that. If you peek in there, they're still brood. They're still brood being taken care of inside the colony they are keeping it warm they they shiver and and keep that nest warm all the way through but they cluster up and do that so they don't really hibernate as traditional you know mammals will do they uh they can if it gets cold enough you can see up here there's a few bees that really aren't moving very fast at all they're kind of just hanging out they probably have a little bit of torpor going on torpors where their exoskeletons sort of atrophy and seize up. So that's what they look like. I figured I'd share that with everyone. You know, this is definitely during the winter, we don't have a lot of activity to be able to, to make videos, but anytime I have a chance to share what bees are doing, we love to do it here at the Bohemia Apiary. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. Um, make sure you share with your friends and continue to check in on the bees as we uh, continue to monitor them throughout the winter. Look, there's even some condensation that's starting to get here on the glass from me having to open this up because the heat inside and the cool here in this and the uh, actual honey room where it's at in our harvest honey room, you can see here, it's probably about, I don't know, 60 degrees in here, but it's about 90 degrees right there in that cluster. So let me close them up, keep them warm, try not to disturb them too much. They don't eat up all the resources and we'll check on them another day. Thanks for watching. Follow us on all the social media. And uh, remember here at Haney Aviary, beekeeping is definitely more than a hobby. It's an obsession. Thanks for watching, everyone.